Hello everybody, welcome to today's vlog. I uploaded the video and I am ready to pass the fuck out. It is around 3 o'clock. I uploaded the video early. I'm actually probably going to watch a movie here in a little bit because I'm letting my phone charge. Because my phone was at like 10% when I was editing. I really like to drain my phone a little bit because uh, it gives me opportunity to take a break from the blue light. Always chugging it so when I am watching a movie or something, I'm not always repetitively checking the phone. Because checking the phone is such a habit that I don't want to have anymore. That's why I deleted social media and all of that shit because it seems like... I'm still just always checking it because of Discord, but I like to use Discord. I have a whole bunch of friends on Discord, like I say, every day. And so I use Discord a lot to keep in touch with my friends. So being uh, that the Discord app is the only app that I normally check, I still feel like I am regularly still checking my phone. So that's why I let my phone battery just drain and I just chuck it in the corner for an hour or two, watch a movie, and get a break because my eyes were like strained. Like when I was always checking my phone when I had social media on it, I was my eyes would twitch, my eyes would not feel healthy and they would just feel itchy all the time and I was always touching my eyes from checking my phone because they were dry as shit from always checking it. So if you're having those similar issues, I highly suggest that you delete social media because social media can be a huge waste of time. It can be a huge distraction for what you really, really need to be getting done. Say for instance, you want to clean your bedroom and you're always just checking social media. That's a distraction. And if you're being distracted from cleaning your bedroom like, like I need to do, then delete the social media because it's it's literally I had a conversation about this with my mom the other night um and uh, we both agreed that there's just, was just a, a whole waste of time that's why I deleted Facebook Instagram Snapchat because they're just they're useless social media for to just fill up space in your day when you're bored as shit and you've got nothing else to do and uh, it's, I could get I could go into this I, I I can make a whole separate video on this topic let me know if you guys want me to do like more like serious topics or uh, more sit down type of videos with the vlogs because the vlogs are different. The vlogs really just showcase what I am doing throughout through day to day. If you guys want me to start like not like a podcast, but like uh, a mini series where I do my in depth or non like biased opinion about certain things, let me know in the comments or leave a like on this video, and I will do so because I feel like if I do more unique sort of uh, thought based topics that my channel might get some more views and I've been really thinking about wanting to put a series on my channel about certain ideas that I have and ideologies that I would like to put out onto the internet and see if some people have the same thoughts and opinions as I do and maybe we can start a, a conversation, a respectful conversation because I like to talk to people, that's why I daily vlog, I like to talk to people and I like to get to know other sides of people that they don't really get to show to other people. You know, that's, I guess that's the whole point of a community, so that you can show your other side that you don't get to normally show with the normal day-to-day -day people that you do normally see, like your family or your normal just everyday friends, you know what I'm saying? Like, I am not, who you see me on camera, I no don't really normally show in front of my family because I, I, uh, am not so comfortable in front of my family as I really should be, and I, I just, I, 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 do, I just don't do that, so. Uh, who I am on camera is who I am on real life and who I am with my homies. My homies every day do see this side of Bennett and some people that I know don't really see this side of me. Like people in my high school, you know, they suck. But uh, my old high school, I've been out of high school for five years. Uh, yeah, they, they don't get to see what uh, I am truly like, like me who is talking to you. But, um, yeah, let me know if you guys want me to talk about more serious topics. I'm done on that tangent. But, yeah, let me know if you guys want me to talk about more serious topics, and I will be gladly to, uh, 
upload those. I just don't know what to call this series if I were to, if I was going to upload something besides the vlogs on my channel, maybe like once a week on a Saturday, uh, or maybe I'll live stream it, and we'll see, we'll see if that goes on, but yes. Anyways, I am going to get into this bed, and I am going to throw on a movie, and I will just see you guys tomorrow morning. It is now almost 4.30 p.m. I thought I'd stop and say what's up. Uh, last night I slept alright. Uh, I, wa I finished watching the Am Amityville horror movie, not the fucking 2005 version, the fucking uh, 1974 version, which I thought was way more entertaining than the 2005 version. The 1974 version uh, had a little bit more scares in it than the, the 2005 version. The 2005 version kind of, it, it, it didn't really tell the story very well, but I, I gotta rewatch the 2005 version. It's been a while since I've seen the 2005 version. I think it's been about like two years since I've seen the 2005 version. I think I'm gonna watch the 2005 version later tonight. Uh, we'll see how it goes, but I don't know if I if I will, because I'm gonna hit up Jacob and see if he finishes projects, and we might stream Halo tonight because we we need to get Halo 2 done so we can move on to fucking Halo 3 and 4 and so on. Uh, we've just been slacking because, like I said, he's he's Project Boy. But, um, yeah, going to watch the Amityville Horror Movie tonight, probably. Probably the 2005 version. I'm going to try and watch it all the way through. Uh, the original one was almost two hours long, and I think this one, the 2005 version, is almost the same length. The reason why I don't really like the 2005 version one, uh, 2005 version one very much is because 2000 between 2000 and 2005 horror movies weren't really that good they were actually kind of cheesy like i know what you did last summer and what else came out to uh as uh, as above so below uh 28 days later like all these cheesy horror movies started coming out around those times and they're, they're they weren't really good really the highest pro pro produced horror movie at that time, I think, was in the Amityville uh, horror movie, which, by the way, the Amityville horror movie is a real, uh, was based off of a real murder case, um, I forget where and who, uh, uh, where and what it was, but it is based off of a real murder case, and, uh, it's an interesting murder case to look into, I just forget, I forget what it, uh, some man, uh, some, some house, some guy went insane and killed his family, and it, it's crazy. It's based off a real story, but I can't remember the real names of the people right now because I'm just, I'm tired. Uh, I slept okay last night. I think I woke up about twice. I had a hard time falling asleep. I think I just need to buy new pillows or something because I'm, I'm having such a hard time trying to fall asleep. Uh, I don't drink caffeine that much throughout the day. I, I, I finish my coffee around five or six o'clock or even closer to seven and I drink water for the rest of the night and then I just edit and then I just, I take my melatonin and I still just end up having a hard time trying to fall asleep uh, I, I don't know if there's like a science behind it but uh, maybe I should go get neurologically checked but I, I, I don't want to go through cat scans I have claustrophobia I don't want to go somewhere where I'm being uh, sleep deprived for a certain amount of hours to see if anything is fucked up with my brain because that just seems like a waste of time on my part because if I'm just being sleep deprived then yeah obviously there's gonna be something fucked up with me at that current state because I'm being sleep deprived at that moment in time trying to see what is causing the problem it's just like well if I'm being caused a problem there's going to be a problem without me being able to fix it you see what I'm talking about so going to a doctor or a psychological therapist to see what's wrong with my brain to see if I can get help being fixed of sleep seems like an issue all on its own and a waste of money that I just don't want to find out a problem that I, oh oh I'm in an insomniac really I didn't know I was an insomniac I really couldn't tell me going to bed at five o'clock in the morning every day was causing me to not be able to sleep you know what I'm saying it's like well I, I knew that I think I'm gonna play drums here in a few minutes 
because uh, my arm actually, my arm is actually almost 100% healed. It's like 99% better. I can actually like do shit. It's not in pain or anything like that. So I think I'm gonna play drums right now, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just practice and have a good time, and uh, we'll see what's going on throughout the day. I'm gonna run today as well because I run every day, and I think I'm gonna hit up Greg and see if he's down to lift some weights uh, early in the day. But uh, who knows? Greg's been college boy and he's been tired, so uh, we'll see what's going on. One day out of the weeks that I've said I'm down to work out more is not okay so I gotta get up a workout regimen going even more so we'll, we'll we're, we're gonna we're gonna get that going so yeah thank you so much for listening to me rant and uh, I'll pick it up throughout the day it is almost seven o'clock and I am getting ready for my run here I am going to stream today and tomorrow because I, I didn't stream this Saturday because Greg Flu uh, Greg flunked and he fluked. So, uh, streaming tonight, I'm gonna finish Rambo, and then I'm streaming again tomorrow because Jacob was like, yeah, I'm gonna finish all my projects today, and I am down to play some Halo tomorrow, so I'm going to be streaming Halo tomorrow, which is going to be really fun time and I can't wait to stream Halo for a couple of hours because uh, we're I want to finish Halo 2 really badly like I've been saying for the past couple of days Halo 2 needs to be finished Halo 2 fucking just needs to be completed because we've been playing Halo 2 for months and it, 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 we just we just dropped it so it needs to be done I'm gonna finish my coffee right now drink a little bit of water and then I'm gonna stretch up and head on my run Cause you know me, I run every day. If I don't run, then it's um, it's like me not playing drums. It's gonna be an inadequate day if I don't do things I don't enjoy doing every single day. So yeah, I'm gonna call this clip here, and I'll either see you on my run or I will see you when I'm finishing the stream. Sometimes I just forget to vlog on my run because I'm enjoying myself. But um, yeah, we'll we'll see you throughout the day. All right, friends, it is now 11.13 p.m., and I gotta turn the 48 volt off of my interface. I streamed, I just ended the stream like 15 minutes ago. <sighs> my throat is so tired from talking for so, mo for so long. I need to get used for, I need to get used to talking for that long again. And, man, uh, streaming's getting, I'm getting back into the rhythm things of, of streaming, and I'm really excited to stream Halo tomorrow with Jacob, because that's gonna be... That's going to be so much fun, and I can't wait to gain some new viewership from that. And it's, I'm really starting to enjoy streaming again, especially since I'm just going to stream whenever the fuck I want. And I'm, I am going to take, take it slow. I'm not going to bombard myself with problems that I had last year or two years ago by streaming every day. Because it's impossible to like stream every day. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. I need to minimize the Google Chrome and exit out of Steam so I'm not looking at my monitor. Um, yeah, so streaming's going very well. I stream for about two to three hours a day, and I think I'm I'm going somewhere with it. It's, it's, it takes a toll on me, but it's fun. I think I'm actually gonna call this video here because it is almost midnight. Nothing's going on in the rest of my life right now to be filmed for, so gotta call it here. Thank you guys so much for coming along for my journey today. I really do greatly appreciate it. Your time is my time, and I think I like to put in a lot of time in these videos. You guys know what to fucking do. If you guys want to subscribe, subscribe. If you guys want to leave a like, leave a like. If you guys want to comment something, comment something down below, and I will reply. Share the video. Ding dong that notification bell. And as always, I will see you guys here tomorrow at 9.15 a.m. for the next daily vlog.